Some Zimbabwe living in object poverty are reacting angrily to claims by President Emerson Nangaba that the country's economy is the fastest growing in the Southern African region. Economists and members of the main opposition say the president is being misinformed and does not understand basic economics. At the just and the United Nations General Assembly, Zimbabwean President Emerson Nankab said this country's economy was the fastest growing in Southern Africa. We are recording unprecedented development and economic milestones. For the last three years, our country has been the fastest in our Southern African region. Further, Zimbabwe is prioritizing the eradication of poverty and improving the quality of life of our people. But in Harare, light on Germany depends on part-time gardening to make a living. The unemployed, the unemployed seven-year-old says the past three years have been difficult for him. I make so little money that I am fall, failing to send my children to school. I need money to school fees for my wife and for other obligations. I hope I get sponsorship so I can start music and uplift lives to the, of other Zimbabwe. Former Finance Minister Tendai Biti, a leader of the main opposition party, disagrees with President Emerson Mangaba's assessment of the economy. He says the president is seriously ill, formed and misinformed as 39% of the population is living in extreme poverty. Over a third have to rely on food assistance from the WFP World Food Program and the United Nations agencies. More than 90% of the population is in formal employment. Everywhere you go, there is decay, decay infrastructure decay in the mindset. So there is a lot of propaganda, there is a lot of misinformation. This is a limply ibono. Prosper Chitambara is a senior economics with the Labour and Economic Development Research Institute of Zimbabwe. He says Zimbabwe's economy took a nose dive in 2019 and 2020 due to cyclone Ida and drought. He is also concerned about the effects of inflation on citizens as well as poverty levels. Our currency has been affected by inflation. We have seen a depreciation of the current, so the value obviously has been dismantled by inflation. Chitamba is that Zimbabwe needs to increase production and stabilize its currency so it can think of sustained growth and reaching an upper middle income economy, which President Naga wants to achieve by the 2030.